Who runs around in the forest just going like... Hey guys, welcome back to the kingdom. My name's Alexa and I'm back here with another reaction video. Today we're gonna have a little bit of a different vibe because I think usually I only ever do world-renowned artists in the commercial scene, but I thought, you know what, I kind of want to have some fresh faces slash emerging talents and see if we can really build future generation of artists out there. Not to say that this person is particularly low-key, I think they're definitely doing extremely well in the commercial scene and I thought it'd be really nice to check him out and see if he's any good. His name is Mergi, if I'm not mistaken, and he's recently come out with a song called Paradise. I think he came out with this song about a couple months ago, but I haven't heard it and I thought, you know what, why not? Before we start the video, please don't forget to check out my social media. I got Instagram, I got Twitter, I got TikTok, and most importantly, I have been a part of duo act called LXD. Please, please, please check us out. It's me and my best friend and together we make this cinematic, dark, I don't know, epic pop electronic I don't know I don't know what genre it is actually it'd be really great if you guys can let us know and that way we know exactly how to label our music I'll put the link into Spotify right at the bottom and yeah check out our handles let's do this I'm excited I'm excited Okay, the verse is good. I think it's quite bouncy. I, I really like the beat. It's quite nice. I think especially since his voice is quite laid back, you kind of need the beat to be a little bit more energetic just to kind of have that balance. I think it's it's pretty vibey so far. Okay, before we continue, I actually really like that change because in the verse, he went pretty low with his vocals in terms of the key and the pitch and everything. And then eventually he went higher. And that sounds absolutely amazing, mostly because it kind of gives it that evolution and that movement in the song. And that way you feel like you're in this next part of the story, which is incredibly, incredibly important if you want the audience to have a very keen interest throughout the whole song. We just gotta dig Okay, yeah, I love that. I love the fact that right before they did the drop, the chorus, the big moment in the song, they had a little bit of a pause. Brings like that suspense, makes you kind of catch your breath before it has a nice, nice release. Nice. Okay, I don't know if you guys noticed that, but follow me, follow me, follow me, follow me down. Great. The melody is working with the lyrics, especially since you're saying that you want someone to follow you down. Or I, I'm, I'm, I'm not gonna lie to you. I'm not listening to the lyrics, so I have absolutely no idea what it's about. But I'm assuming you're following someone down, or they're spiraling down, or something of such. And the fact that you're using that to express that melodically as well, where you're going na 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 na, it's making you act feel that movement of that person going down with you. Nice. Interesting. That's weird. He didn't even say the down bit at the end. You know what? That makes it exciting. I like it. Great. I'm interested to see if whether he's gonna continue the verse in a similar way or if he's gonna switch it up. Hold on tight. We can break the speed of Okay, like I'm not even trying to be funny, but what the f is this video about? <laughs> I genuinely have no idea what the song's about and I don't feel like personally the video is making me understand it more. Okay, wait, hold on. Hold on, because now I'm invested in the music video. Who runs around in the forest just going like... <laughs> Sorry. 
it's not it's not that I hate it. This is not me hating whatsoever. I'm actually really liking the video, but I just find that so fun. I find that so fun. So come here tonight. Guys can run. He runs like a superhero. Like it's a, it's a sexy run, almost. You know what I mean? Okay, so they've kind of elong they've elongated the chorus a little bit more. It's, it's simple, they're not adding any more lyrics into it, but I think that specific bit right there is literally just to emphasize that line. I feel like a lot of the times people get really peeved off with reputation in pop music, and I totally understand that, and I can understand how that could be really irritating, or I think some people think it's such an easy way or cop-out way to write music, but I think what people tend to don't understand is that repetition is a technique for you to remember the song more. If it's playing on the radio 24 seven or playing on YouTube, or if it's in every single ad or every single TikTok reel, fine, that's a different story. But the point of the repetition in the song, if you will only ever hear it once in your life, is that they want you in that one time that you listen to it, remember that bit that is repeated. There's no point repeating something that they don't want you to remember, right? <laughs> Here now. Is that just me? Oh, never mind. Never mind. There's a car crash. Wait, what? Wait, hold on. Wait, hold on. Then why is there a crash and then there's smiling and then there's kissing and then there's like a car upside down? What is going on? Come close to me. For we say goodbye. Okay, let's listen to the lyrics. Follow me, follow me, follow me, follow me down. <laughs> that was really good. Mergue, paradise lyrics. So we're gonna go to the one and only trustworthy music match. I mean, I don't really know music match is that trustworthy to be honest, but you know what? It's good enough from it, right? Night, dark outside. We won't make it out alive. Eyes don't want to make them cry, but we're running out of time. Used to think we'll never, used to think we'll never it go go. Huh? Used to think we'll never it go go. Used to think we'll never let it go go, but every little drama was a promo. They only see us kissing in the photos, but it's all a lie. We just got addicted to the feeling, so we keep pretending we ain't bleeding, bleeding, so come here tonight. That's pretty if you actually think about it, if you are in a relationship just for publicity or you're there doing it just to, you know, further your career and everything, I find that quite sad. Not in a sense that like I find you pathetic. I don't think it's particularly pathetic. I just think it's quite sad that someone feels the need to actually do that in order to benefit their life or I guess be forced in a situation where they think they have to do it. I'm not judging anyone that does do it and I'm not gonna judge anyone that has done it before, but it does make me sad. I don't know, maybe I'm, maybe I'm crazy. I got a one-way ticket all the way to paradise, so follow me, follow me, follow me, follow me down. Down? Why would paradise be down? We got a chance to see the light before we saw goodbye, so follow me, follow me, follow me, follow me down. Okay, let's, let's do the next bit. Ride, hold on tight, we can break the speed of light, and I, at least for one last night, wanna make you feel alive even if we're dead inside. Jesus! Wanna make you feel alive even if we're dead inside? Used to think we'll never, we'll, we'll never it go-go. What does that mean? We used to think we'll never it go-go. Is this a mistake? Is this a typo? Hold on, let me listen back because this doesn't make sense in my head. Okay, it's let it go. It's used to think we'll never let it go-go. Okay, I don't know. Music match is not trustworthy in this video. But every little drama was the promo, Donna. They only see us kissing in the photos. 
but it's all a lie. Okay, great. So it's basically a repeat of the previous one. That makes sense. It's giving it structure. It's giving it some form of predictability as well. That way the audience knows exactly where it's meant to go and can repeat the same lyrics without overthinking it in their head. The chorus is going to be exactly the same. They're not going to change it. That's fine with me. Though I don't understand why there's a one-way ticket to paradise, which is going down i mean unless you're referencing to hell oh oh my god what if it's like and this is just my interpretation so don't don't come at me if it's if you think it's wrong or if it's genuinely wrong like i don't know but maybe people kind of have this assumption that paradise is when fame is involved when the cameras are on you and you're glamorous and you're this hollywood star that actually maybe paradise is not being involved in all of that and not faking it um, and covering yourself. Actually, paradise is just being an average human being, doing their job, loving who they love, being with their family, and just enjoying life in the most common way. Which is why from this kind of Hollywood love lifestyle, it's better just to trickle down into an average but beautiful love where no one can judge it or break it. Okay, let's continue. Ooh, 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 ooh. That's meaningful. So follow me, follow me, follow me, follow me down. Ooh, 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 ooh. Fabulous. Fall, 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 fall me down. Great. Say you're coming with me. I got one more ticket before we say goodbye. So fall, 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 fall me down. So you say you're coming with me. I got one more ticket before we say goodbye. So fall, 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 fall me down. Did you know that there's a line called follow me down? <laughs> I'm gonna be totally real. This is actually a pretty, pretty decent song. The lyrics are simple and catchy enough for a younger audience to really get into it. Obviously don't know the demographic that they're targeting, but I have to assume that just based off of the vibe of this music video in particular, and just kind of looking at how the artist is presenting himself, he definitely looks like a heartthrob. So I can imagine all the teens swooning over him. But in that case, if you are kind of hitting that teenage girl demographic. I feel like the lyrics are really nice. Like, follow me, follow me to paradise. I want to take you with me, come with me. You know, like that. Oh, I don't know about that sentence. Um, <laughs> Sorry. All right, guys, I think that's gonna be it for today. Thank you so much for watching. If you guys want to suggest the next song that is trending, please let me know. Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below of Mergi and his song Paradise. And uh, I guess I'll see you guys really soon.